Hi guys. Um, I just got out of a really long shower, which is, if you know me in person, or if you've lived with me and I've annoyed you with it, um, I, if I'm like really in my head or if I really need to just think about something, I take really long showers and I just took like a two hour shower. I had a lot on my mind. I have a lot that I want to say that I want to talk about with somebody, with anybody, and I feel like I, I feel like I don't have that anymore. I feel like I don't have anyone to talk to anymore, and that was driving me crazy because for the last couple weeks, from the last since my grandmother passed, like I have just been. I'll be honest. I've been in a really dark place. I've. I've not been okay. I've been asked if I'm okay. I've been telling people I'm fine, and things haven't been fine. I've been battling these everything, battling everything in my head. I had to literally sit down in my mirror and look at myself in the eyes and be like, dude, what? What is up? What is wrong with you? What? why is everything not working out it, it's is it me is it you is it the energy you're putting into the world like what is going on why are you in this space and you know i was thinking and i i've kind of known this but a lot of my problem is my own opinion about myself my own feelings about my self-worth you know you see somebody on social media you see influent influencers celebrities and you see them having a great time and i always had it in my head you know they're just like me they're posting happy pictures but really they're sad on the inside or they're just it's this big social media world where you're supposed to look happy but really on the inside you're not happy and then i meet these people i get the opportunity to go out into the real world and meet these people in real life and i see that their lives are actually what they're showing these people are actually happy and they are actually doing what they want and getting what they want out of life most of them for the most part and i don't know my biggest flaw in myself that I wish I could change. There's a lot of things that I know are wrong about myself um, and I try to change them but the one thing that I can't seem to shake is that I have a huge problem with jealousy, with feeling like, and I think this comes from also being on social media, um, getting lots of comments and stuff about you're great, you're fantastic, you're this, you're that, you're so cute, you're all of this stuff, all the stuff that you want to see in yourself and you don't, but other people say that they see, they build you up and you have this idea in your head that you are better than you think you are. And then when life doesn't treat you that way, when life doesn't give you what these people say that you should have, and you see other people who maybe in your head you think you're better than that. you think you're better than these people and they have it all and they're doing more and it really weighs on you and it shouldn't it's stupid it's we all are on our own life journeys and our own life paths and you should never get hung up on what you don't have and really focus on what you do have and I had to sit in the shower and I thought and I thought and I thought about it and I finally came to this conclusion I uh, looked at myself under a microscope and I told myself the the reason these people have what they have the reason you don't have what you want is because you're not working on it. You're not putting in what you need to put in to get there. If something is what you want to do that bad, as bad as you say you are, if you want to do something so bad that you're getting depressed, that it's not happening, it's because you're not trying hard enough to make it happen. You keep 
giving up and what that stems from is from being depressed and having mental health issues and that's sometimes it makes you just like feel like I can't do it so I won't do it instead of sitting around feeling sorry for myself I am not going to let those thoughts affect me getting what I want, getting where I want. You know, I have good things going for me. I may not be in LA living it up with my friends. I may not be getting the same amount of likes as someone else. I may not be getting the same opportunities as someone else and a lot of what I'm like talking about really stems from like a single thing and I will be honest I don't feel like I have any friends anymore right and I don't know what I did I don't know what happened so I just really need to vent and that's what this is gonna be and that's what I'm gonna do and if you don't like that you can unsubscribe I'm making myself not care about that stuff anymore that's not what it's about there's a few of you that I've known from the very beginning since I started doing anything and you've been so supportive and so amazing and so kind. You come to things, you lift me up when I feel down. I want to show you that it wasn't for nothing, that you did help me and I am doing something and I am getting somewhere and I'm... Uh, this video is going to be a hot mess. I'm sorry. This is just... I'm not even going to like post about this. This video is just going to be a hot mess. And what I'm trying to make this video... Everything I'm trying to say... Usually I script out what I'm going to say. And I didn't do that this time. I'm just word vomiting how I feel. I looked at this video. I looked at this day as the first day of the rest of my life. The first day of me not caring what other people think of me, not caring about the mean comments, not caring about the opportunities that are being given to my peers that I thought were told that I would get, but someone else keeps getting them, everyone else keeps getting them. It's not worth it. It's like what I'm doing doesn't make me happy enough in the first place to let it affect me so hard. There's other things like talking to you, connecting to the people who actually do give a f flip about me. I just started learning about monetization so I can't say bad words. But just connecting with you, with those who I already love and I know love me back, that's what's important to me. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with this anymore. Basically, I just wanted to take a minute and just say thank you. Thank you for those who have really tried to build me up, who have been there from the beginning, building me up through my restraining orders on people, through heartbreak, through losing friends, um, losing family crazy roommates it's just it's been a crazy few years and it's really just taken its toll every single thing has just chiseled me away and the only thing keeping my structure has been you guys i'm gonna start making videos like this every week where i'm literally just honest i just want to be honest about what what i'm going through what i'm experiencing um not make videos about superficial things that I'm told I have to take down. Stop trying to make myself something that I'm not to make everyone else happy. I'm gonna focus on being the best me I can be. So this is gonna be a lot of maybe workout stuff, a lot of story times, a lot of just me telling you how my day went, how I'm keeping up, a lot of things nobody knows that I w want to start being honest with because I know there's other people out there who feel how I feel because you message me and you DM me and you ask and I don't know what to say because I can't even be honest with myself about my own issues so how am I supposed to help 
somebody else. We are going to get through this together and we're going to struggle through this together and I think things could be really great. I'm not saying I won't have my down days. Everyone has their down days. I'm just saying that I am done letting petty, superficial social media, people who have been handed things, I'm done looking at that as a reflection of myself and my self-worth because it's not and because I'm getting older and there's more important things in life there's things that I want for my life for the future and then on the track I'm going now I am never I'm so far away from that so if you're still watching um, thank you for making it this far thank you for hearing me out thank you um, for always being there always supporting me and I hope you continue while I go through these changes to support me and I will be there to support you and we can do this together because that's what we need that's what the world needs um that's what I need I love you it's gonna be rough and it's gonna be weird hopefully I didn't bore you too much and if I did next video we'll, we'll have more fun Excuse me while I come back together. All right, all right, all right, I'm done. I'm done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.